like a bow. So I once had a female friend who was a jiu-jitsu fighter and she was an amazing fighter. I forgot what belt she was. But nevertheless though, before I even saw her fight, I used to train as well in jiu-jitsu. I used to do Muay Thai and jiu-jitsu before I broke my jaw. But she was a very cute looking girl and she didn't look like she could fight. You see her face, she looked like she had a very angelic face. You know, she had that like all American look face, you know what I'm saying? Like that Amy looking, um, Amy looking kind of girl. And, but when she went to the mat and she started sparring, like, shit, shit got real. Like she turned into a fucking beast. You know, she turned into Serena Williams, man. It's like, it's like crazy. So because of that same reason, that made me become fascinated by her. And I actually started to have a crush on her. Because I saw one side, which was normal, you know, the nice, decent looking girl, you know, all American girl. But when she got in the ring, everything changed. And so I was like, damn, shit, it's kind of like nice, but evil at the same time. You know what I'm saying? Don't get into an argument with her. So what's really going on here is these are more mixed signals. You see, the angelic look makes guys want to comfort her paternally. Like, yeah, that's, a very, that's a paternal type of attraction that you have. But the dark side is what creates the polarity. You see, the niceness, the warmth is what draws them in. The dark side is what creates, turns the interest into desire and love. All right? So these contradictions is what makes guys think of you more than just the person that you are. All right? So you kind of like become their fantasy because they can't really understand you. Like, it doesn't make sense why you're so nice, but at the same time you have an evil side. So because of that contradiction, you don't know what to think of her, or what, what to think of the person. As a result, you, you start to create your own fantasy of the person. Maybe not even reflect reality, but you're go, your brain is going to start creating things. That's why people say, that's why you may say to yourself, why do guys think I'm so cool? Why do you guys want to talk to me? Like sometimes I even, I don't, sometimes I can't find myself, well, I don't know why they think I'm interested when in reality I'm not interested. It's because they're seeing, their brain is seeing something that's not there. You see? So that infatuation only occurs when you give them that space to think of you, that space to actually be fascinated about you, but you, that only happens when you have that contradiction. You see, that fascination only happens when you have that contradiction to your personality. All right? So, they'll see, okay, all right. So, anyway, so you have that, right? So, a way, the innocence of the vulnerability, like I said earlier, is what attracts them. Like, the niceness, the, the warmth to you, you know? But your dark side is what turns you into an obsession. Guys move on, guys will move on and stop being interested if you're just the nice girl. Like, just the nice girl. Like, I will always be there for you and I will never leave you. That side, guys are going to leave or cheat on. I'm telling you why. Because they need another side that's dark. That's why they'll go for girls that are uglier per se. That's why, that's why girls always complain about like, he cheated on me with a girl who's uglier. But they do that because they want a girl who, who, like, who goes for stuff, who, 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 who's willing to take risks. They want a dark side. You see? So when they find that in a woman, it's like finding a LeBron James who could do everything. You know, so when you do that, guys will, will become more interested a lot more, a lot longer, enough to, for them to fall in love with you. All right, so that's why being overly masculine as a woman, like when you're just too much of a tomboy, you know, isn't good. It's because you want to balance it out. You know, you need to have a feminist, a feminine side to balance it out. So guys like that because it, it kind of like having a masculine side to you. Let's say your feminine side, have a masculine side to you. Because when you have a masculine side to you, which is the best kind of person, because when you have that, those two sides, it means you have the best parts of being a man and the best parts of being a woman. When you have that masculine side, in a way, it brings out a repressed homosexual desire that guys have. Don't you notice why guys like girls who do manly stuff? Why guys like girls who, who, who wear their jeans? Or guys like girls who play sports? Or guys like girls who are competitive? Like, very masculine traits. So it's kind of like an indirect way to fulfill a fantasy. Now, the, like, I don't have those, you know? Don't ever, don't, 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 spread, don't start spreading that. I don't have it. <laughs> I bet I do, man. I swear to God, I bet I do. In a way, this, let me show you something. In a way for that to come out, it's kind of like when you, when you start seeing the, 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 the female version of you, when you start, like, people like the, the, the opposite, se opposite sex version of them. So when you see someone that reminds you of you and they're the opposite sex, you kind of fall in love with them. You see? That, because that's also a homosexual desire that everyone has. All right, so... But in order for this to work, it has to hint that you, that, 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 that you have a, another side to you. You can't be so obvious. You know what I'm saying? The reason why I found out that this girl was a, my friend, was a jiu-jitsu fighter is because I saw an Instagram photo of her like having a jiu-jitsu mat. 
but she never really advertised it. She just had one picture of her jiu-jitsu. So I asked her and she took me. So it was something that was more subtle. I didn't ask for it. I mean, she didn't say, she, I, I noticed and, she, and then I brought it up. So I didn't feel like she was trying to impress me, you see? So what, what is to say that she didn't do that on purpose? You see what I'm saying? Like, what is it she didn't do that on purpose? She did the right thing because I found out indirectly, right? So, but the thing is, is that the, having this, I'm like, one second, I'm reading the most. To fix it, you must hint that you are complex. All right, so by having, by having that, by having like the little counterbalance of your personality, it hints that you have, that you have depth to your personality, all right? So right now we're going to learn how to, how to use it and how to apply it, all right? So in order to apply, you have to realize you won't have to become a walking paradox. You see a walking paradox. Like look one way and be the other. So look like a nice girl. If you're like if you're a badass girl, you know what I'm saying? Like the girl who loves a party, have a nice girl facade. Like a masquerade being a nice girl. You see? People like it because humans want things that make sense. You see? They become curious when th when when there's this when there's this continuity. A lack of continuity that they have to put together. You know, if it's too obvious, people will lose interest. What I mean by that is people want something that doesn't make sense. So if you look like a nice girl, but then you have a dark side to you, I'm like, what the fuck? Like, that's not normal. So they become intrigued and don't want to figure it out. Like, how does all, how does all of this fit together? You see, they see a gap and that gap, they fill it up with their imagination. And that imagination is what stirs up the desire. You see, but in order for that to do that, you got to do it in a very strategic way because I'm going to show you how to do it. All right. So I'm just putting down some basic fundamentals for you guys to understand. All right, and so, but the, remember when I told you, if it's too obvious, they'll lose interest. So like that girl, she did it in a very subtle way. I was the one who approached her for that, not her. So it was subtle, even though it was intentional, you know. So if you show, if, if, the thing is that if you show too much of yourself, like the good parts of you, the parts that people obviously like, it'll, it, they, they'll, they'll become interested, but they'll, they'll lose interest afterwards. You see what I'm saying? You don't want that. You want them to find out slowly you wanted to find out and then like see a little bit of see a little bit of the gold like see a little bit of the gold in the sand make him curious enough to go there and start digging you see so remember no one is a, is mysterious by nature like people are not mysterious by nature we all want validation i gotta put some honey on my coffee you know no one is mysterious by, by nature because we all want validation you know um so in order for you to actually be mysterious I and mean, that guy actually wants to get to know you you have to actually put some effort. And that's why people lose interest because the person doesn't, lose, doesn't put effort. And that's a good thing. Is that if that's the case, that means anyone could do it if they put a little bit of effort. You know, anyone could give a good gift if they, if they actually put some effort. It's for every single person. You could tell good effort from bad effort. You know, so show one part of your cat character that's obvious, you know, and then the other. You know, so have, have a facade. Find out what your facade is. Find out who you really, really are and suppress it. All right, ladies, so finally, I have released my second course for women, which is Natural Chemistry. This course is a five-week course, five-week course where every week you're going to get a new set of videos based on, based on specific issues. The, this course is all about how to create and maintain the attraction in any man. This will help you create love. This will help you deepen the love with your man. This is not about manipulation. This is not about playing games. This is genuine, genuine, natural chemistry. No more short-term partners. No more being fooled. Why? Because I will reveal to you not only how to create attraction in the first week, but also how to understand male nature, how to understand their tricks, how to prevent from being a too attached, signs that he's the wrong guy, signs that he's a narcissist, signs that he's a mama's boy, signs that he's an emotionally available guy, emotionally unavailable guy. We go over everything. We go over this third week, setting boundaries. We go over the third week, controlling your emotions, right? Setting boundaries, fourth week, fifth week, embracing your masculine and the feminine, right? And on top of that, I come, I have over 10 different bonuses, 10 different bonuses, my Lord have mercy, right? With, with a money back guarantee. The bonus are one, the natural chemistry, over 10 hours of content, right? The breakup formula, how to deal with a breakup, right? The connecting with your man, right? Establishing a life of abundance, social mastery, understanding your dark side, the goal setting seminar, which is about how to set and achieve goals, practical mastery that will teach you how to master anything. The laws of human nature. I will come that I have a book club for the laws of human nature with over four hours of content, right? 
the transformational seminar in a pocket, which is my mindfulness seminar and the Chase audiobook. This is a this originally is one thousand eight hundred dollars, but you get it starting at ninety seven dollars, ladies and gentlemen. Right, ninety seven dollars. We have different packages, but all of this starts at ninety seven dollars. And you know what? You can check it out for free if you want. Yeah, for all the freeloaders, I have free videos just for you. Free videos, all right? So you could just check it out for free and then you could get out. Nothing wrong with that, all right? So, and on top of that, it comes with a 30 day money back guarantee. No questions asked. That's right. No questions asked. I don't mind. I just want you guys to check it out because I know when you take one look, you're going to want to buy it. I could promise you, just like my other course, um, the psychological the psychological game of attraction, it was a hit. You're gonna love this one. This one is not about manipulation. This is genuine natural chemistry. Order it now. All right. I'll see you guys inside. Peace out.